In this tutorial, we'll look at making the transition from FL Studio Mobile 2 to 3 and your content, songs, instruments and samples. Tap on the Home button to show the home page. Under the Songs tab, you will find your projects listed at the top here, above the demo songs. What about your purchased instruments? First of all, when you open FL Mobile 3, you'll be asked to register the application to your ImageLine account. Make sure to do this, as it is how Mobile 3 will learn about your Mobile 2 purchases. Once that's sorted, your purchased instruments will show for download on the Shop tab. So what about your custom and personal instruments? These are accessed via the DirectWave plugin. I'll start with a new project. The default template includes a drum instrument and two synthesizer instruments. If I open the channel rack here on the right, you can see the bass and the lead are both mini synth. We need to add a direct wave sampler track. Do that from the plus button here and select direct wave. When you do that, you'll see the instruments listed for direct wave. This list will include your purchased instruments and your custom installed instruments and samples. Tapping on synth bass opens the library and I can preview samples. Tapping along the name will change the pitch. Now tapping the playlist will close it and allow you to edit notes in the piano roll or play the instrument. Enjoy.